today I'm going to be opening up another box of 23-24 OPG Hockey looking for Connor Bedard. Let's get into it. All right, like I said in the intro, got another box of OPG Hockey looking for Connor Bedard. If you haven't seen my first video with me opening this box, I definitely recommend checking it out. I was pretty damn lucky with what I pulled considering it wasn't the craziest pool when you look at it, but still hoping to have the same kind of luck today looking for Connor Bedard. We're just going to get right into it. Please, looking for, like I said, Connor Bedard is who you want in this box. Anything, even the base rookie, you still want over anything else. Yeah, I am over exaggerating the frick out of that statement there is plenty of other things in this box that you could pack that would be way better than a base connor bedard i'm just a clown so yeah please this is this is the time this is pretty much connor mcdavid 2.0 and i wasn't in the hobby at that time i don't believe i was i'm not missing the opportunity to open up Connor Bedard product and pack his stuff because when you look at Connor McDavid's uh, prices for his cards, it's ridiculous. So, might as well take the chance to open up boxes while they're still decent prices. This box I paid $90. Like I said in the first video I opened, I believe it was $90 I paid for these boxes. So, even even if you pack the base rookie of Connor Connor Bedard, they're still $65, $70, I believe, which pretty much pays for the box. And if you get some other decent numbered cards, you pretty much it literally pays for the box. I mean, how can you go wrong? And especially if you pack, I'd say, a numbered card or a, a parallel to the base, it's it's yeah, I'm yeah. If you guys are hockey fans, I definitely recommend opening this stuff up. You cannot beat it for the price that it is. So, yeah, we're just going to get right into it. You get 10 cards per pack. How many packs are in here? What is this? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 18. 18 packs per box. So, please, hoping to have decent luck. Come on. All right, we're already starting off hot. Can't even get this pack open. All right, I'm not going to go through these pretty... I'm not going to go through these as slow. So, I got a Mitch Marner, Travis Boyd Blue, got a Ryan O'Reilly Retro, uh, Carter Hart. Damn, it's so, what a shame. What a shame with, with what's going on with him. Hopefully, he's innocent, but definitely a shame. If he isn't innocent, then, you know, definitely deserves what he's what's happening to him but hopefully he is innocent and he'll be able to return eventually so we got a opg card playing card we got mark andre Fleury, six of clubs do we have a marquee rookie we do sean farrell i have no idea who that is but we got a christian fitcher retro and a couple of base i did open up the first box and i believe i missed a Matthew Nye's marquee rookie. I don't believe his, his, his marquee rookie is going for crazy amounts of money, but probably one of the nicer marquee rookies you want to get. And I completely missed it. What do we have in here? Should we have a black? Please, Connor. If Connor, oh my God, if, if I could pack a black, oh my God, please, Connor Bedard. That would be huge. That would be huge. That would be Martin Nietzsche's. Retro, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. That's a marquee rookie. So we got a zone. All right, so we got a Zach Benson marquee rookie. It's probably one of the nicer ones you'd want to get. High pick in what, 2020, 2023? Yeah, I believe he was a 2023 pick. It's not Connor Bedard. Who is that? Number 79? Is that Buffalo? Who's 79? Sammy Belay. Number two one hundred. We got seventy out of one hundred. So probably one of the nicer marquee rookies you want to get. I'd say so myself. And we already have uh, one of our numbered cards. I believe you get three numbered cards per box. So that is one of those base, base, base. Got Famelka Retro Jeff Skinner. Got a Jake Gensel UC Saros All Star. We got a Klim Costin blue. 
Next pack. Next pack. So we got a OPC Premier. It's red. I believe these are. We got a Stanislav Svozil marquee rookie. I believe these are color match to the to the jersey. I mean to the team. So jersey, yeah. So it's not jersey. Is this Holtz was a year before Simon Nietzsche. Is this is this a Nemich? Oh, Luke Hughes. Okay, so that's definitely a really good one you'd want to get. We got a Luke Hughes OPT Premier rookie. Not numbered, but these are, like I said, jersey team team color match to the to the specific team. So red would be for jersey, but yeah, definitely a nicer one. One of the top rookies behind Connor Bedard you'd want to get. Probably even number two, honestly. I believe. Well, I don't know. I believe you can get Fantilli in here as well. So I don't know. Would you have? Would you rather have Luke Hughes or Adam Fantilli? I'm not sure. They're both insane players, but they are both insane. What is this? All right, we got a playing card. We got a playing card of Jack Eichel. We got a 10 of hearts. We have a Kirill Kaprizov. We got a Nikita Zaitsev retro. All right, first stack down. I'll probably start moving through this a little bit quicker. I keep thinking it's going to be Connor Dorr. I just want to... What is this? What is that? What is that? We got an Emil Andre Marquee rookie. Definitely one for me, my PC. What is this? What do we have here? What is this? It's a thicker card. Oh, dude, imagine if this was Connor Bedard. Oh my God, imagine if this was Connor Bedard. But it's not. It's Matthew Nyes. I don't know how hard these are to pack. But, oh my god, imagine if that was Connor Bedard. Oh my god. It's not. I will definitely take that. Matthew Nyes, marquee rookie. These are, I, I honestly don't even know what these are, to be honest with you. It's a 3D MN. So I guess it's a 3D card. I'm not sure. Where's the box at? Where's the box at? What? I don't even know what these are. What would these even be? I honestly don't even know. I have no idea. Oh, 3D marquee rookies. One in every 864 packs. Holy crap. So that's definitely a crazy pull right there. Dude, imagine if that was Connor Bedard. Oh my god. Oh my god. I will definitely take that though for sure. Of Matthew Nye's 3D, one every 800 and some packs. That's insane. Now that's insane. That is very. I'm definitely going back to my own. So we got another black border. All right. I'm definitely going back to my LCS and getting more of this. This stuff is so so fun to open. I definitely recommend opening this stuff up. Not financial advice, but got another black goaltender. Darcy Kemper. We got a Darcy Kemper black border. Another black border number 190 out of 100. Dude, imagine if that was Connor Bedard. Oh my God. That would have been massive. That would have been massive. But it's not. I'll, I'll take a Matthew Nyes though. I'll definitely take the Matthew Nyes. Maybe I'll try and sell that on eBay. <laughs> All right. Got a Jackson Lacombe marquee rookie. Got a Mark Kastelik. I got a Tomas Tatar retro. Damn, that is so unfortunate. That is so unfortunate. All right, next pack here. Looks like we got another playing card. Got a Jack. Oh, we got a Joker. Okay. So we got a Joker of Bowie. These are the tougher of the cards to pack. Of the playing cards, not the actual card, but yeah, that's probably this is a crazy box so far. I'm not gonna lie, this is an insane box. Holy crap! I'm going back to get more. I might go get a case of this. I might go get a case of this. I might, I might, I honestly might. Another black border. What the heck is going on here? Oh my god, 
Be a Connor Bedard. Be Connor Bedard. Defense. Cody CC. Three black borders in the same box. 27 out of 100. This is the last pack in a second stack. This is insane. This is crazy. So I got a blue border in here. Morgan Frost. Nice. Got an Igor Finisayev, marquee rookie. Got a Brock Nelson blue all-star. And we got a Ryan Reeves red show. One more stack to go. This is a crazy box so far. This is crazy. This is crazy. All right, we got another blue border. Just a bunch of base cards in the back. Nobody cares about the base. All right, we got a Bo Horvat all-star. We got an Alex Newhook. Got a Brandon Montour blue and a Bo Horvat all star. All right. Next pack. Nah, this is crazy. This is crazy. Kevin Hayes on the Flyers. He has not been on the Flyers at all, so definitely not updated. Kevin Hayes. So it looks like we have a no we have a no Kate's retro. We got a Kucherov All Star, and it looks like we have a Platinum Preview Center Center Bead Bedard. The Kings, Byfield, Kopitar. Is this a no? This is not a not a premiere, not a preview. This is just a premiere, not numbered. Premiere, not numbered. Damn, I can't get this back open. Alright, so it looks like we have a red. We got a Silverberg Retro. Just a bunch of base here. We got a Rust. Got a rookie. Not Bedard. Marco Casper. Marquee rookie. And we have a red. We've got a Kutrov All-Star Red. These are not numbered. All right, we got three packs left. Three packs left. Oh my God, I'm still shook over that card, bro. Imagine if that was Connor Bedard. Oh my God, oh my God. TJ Oshie in the retro jerseys. Those jerseys are so nice. There we go, Tyson Forrester, marquee rookie. Definitely put that one aside. We got a Brian Dumoulin blue. We got a Capo Caco retro. And just a bunch of base. Two more packs left. Two more packs. Ooh. Looks like we got a another playing card. Just a bunch of base here. McAvoy TK. We got a four of clubs. Kyle Connor. We got a Connor Hellebuck All Star. We got a Stanislav Svozil. Retro marquee rookie. Just a retro rookie, not marquee rookie. Final pack. Final pack here. Final pack. Looks like we got a William Dufour marquee rookie. We got a Anders Lee retro. And I believe this is a Defenseman Quinn Hughes. We've got a Quinn Hughes, just a premier, not numbered. So that is the box. This being the hit of the box for sure. Imagine, imagine. Damn. Probably end up selling this, to be honest with you. I definitely think that this is probably a decent card now, considering this product just came out. But yeah, definitely a not a bad box. Got a. We got. Th Three, yeah, look at this. We got three black borders. We got a Luke Hughes, which probably is pretty, pretty good. We got a Zach Benson marquee rookie. Three black borders. We got a Joker of Bowie. And then we got that. So, honestly, pretty good box. For only $90, you cannot beat the price. You just can't. So, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned until the next video. Bye.